Trick or Treat is all about candy, which is why we knew we had to check in with Nation Confectioners Association spokesperson, Carly Childhouse. Hey, Carly, how are you? Great, thank you. Thank you so much for having me and happy Halloween season. Happy Halloween season. So what are the most popular Halloween treats that people are getting this year? We knew people would want to know what to get for trick or treaters. And so we asked the question coming in at number one, probably not a surprise to anyone is chocolate. It is a favorite yeah. throughout the whole year. But if you're looking for that little Halloween twist on it, Americans favorite shapes for their Halloween treats are bats ghosts and pumpkins. <laughs> so those are a great fit for chocolate. Next up, we have gummy candy and chewy candy. And you know, a lot of Americans are looking for something a little spooky for the season. And two thirds of them want something with like a creepy or a scary theme. And so those are great options for um, your chewy and gummy treats. And then of course, we cannot talk about the Halloween season and Halloween treats without bringing up the admittedly controversial candy corn. <laughs> no matter how you feel about it, you cannot deny that candy corn is an iconic part of the Halloween season. Yeah, everybody thinks about it. One thing I didn't or I wasn't expecting to see was the lollipops. Why is lollipops <laughs> trending? I mean, hard candy and lollipops are also great fits. These are what Americans said are their favorite Halloween treats this mm -hmm. year. And then we hear there's a right way to eat candy corn, though. <laughs> so how should I mean, we be doing it? That, that is the only way to make a controversial treat more controversial is to ask people <laughs> how they like to eat it. Um, Americans are pretty split on this. 28% of people start with that smaller white end and eat it layer by layer. 15% of people start with that larger yellow end and eat it layer by layer in the other direction. But, you know, more than half of Americans, 57% of them, they just go for it. They eat that whole piece at once. I'm part of the 57. I'm eating the whole thing at once. I'm not thinking about which layer I'm eating. I'm just stuffing <laughs> it in my mouth. <laughs> How much excitement are you seeing throughout the country for Halloween as we approach it? Oh my gosh, there is so much excitement for ha the Halloween season. You've probably started to see candy and decor mm -hmm. and uh, costumes in retailers. People were calling it Summerween and October yeah. and that really does reflect this extended Halloween season that people enjoy. They know that the Halloween season is about more than just the night of October 31st. But don't worry, if your favorite part of the Halloween season is trick-or-treating on October 31st, there are plenty of treats to go around. 97% of people who will welcome trick-or-treaters this year say that they will be giving out chocolate and candy. Oh, perfect. Speaking of chocolate and candy, how does it enhance this Halloween season and make some other special moments throughout the entire year? Yeah, chocolate and candy have this really unique ability to brighten moods, lighten spirits, um, have that little bit of sweetness to any time, whether it's a holiday, a special occasion, or just a little treat yourself moment on an ordinary day. But at the same time, people really do understand that chocolate and candy are treats. So people in the U.S. enjoy chocolate and candy about two to three times per week, which wow. averages just 40 calories and one teaspoon of added sugar per day. And that does include the special what we like to call candy moments like the Halloween season. <laughs> Where can we go for some more information on everything? We have all of your tricks for treating at alwaysatreat.com slash Halloween. And we encourage everyone to join the conversation on social media using the hashtag Halloween treats. Perfect. Thank you, Carly, for joining us tonight. Thank you so much for having me and happy Halloween season. Happy Halloween to you. We'll be right back with more Trick or Treat Week on Good Day State Line.